Known for its history and friendly locals, Lisbon is a great city to explore in Portugal. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide and today we share the things to know before you go to Lisbon. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. So firstly, let's look at the best time to visit. The best time to visit Lisbon is in late spring or early autumn, when the weather is wonderful and warm, but there are less tourists visiting the city. Summer is long and hot, with the busiest months being June through to September. Because of the warm temperature, you can enjoy a day at the beach anytime between May through to the middle of September. Not only is winter a colder month to visit, but it is also quite a bit wetter. But there are some sunny days. The only problem with visiting at this time is that weather can be unpredictable. Hotel prices are cheaper at this time and there are a lot less tourists. Plus, the city is decorated beautifully for Christmas. So now let's look at getting there. There are many ways to get to Lisbon. The Lisbon International Airport is near to the city centre and there are plenty of direct flights available from European cities. You can also fly from cities like Philadelphia, Boston, Miami and New York. From the airport you can catch the Aero Shuttle service that links to the city centre or you can take the Metro which is fast and affordable. You can also catch a train to Lisbon from other cities and towns in Portugal and some may choose to drive to Lisbon as they explore Western Europe. So now let's look at getting around. The most practical way to get around Lisbon is via Metro. The Metro network has four lines and runs from early morning to 1am each day. Lisbon also has six tram lines, which are a fun way to discover the city. The vintage tram number 28 is a tourist attraction in itself and the most popular tram line. The buses will help you travel to areas further out of the city and the commuter train is ideal for those looking to explore the nearby towns. So now let's look at typical prices. Lisbon is one of the cheaper cities to visit in Western Europe, with many attractions costing under 10 euros. You can get a hostel dorm bed for around $34 and budget guest houses begin at around $50. A four or five star hotel starts at around $110 in the low season. A simple breakfast and coffee can be found for under three euros. Lunchtime meals in a cafe begin at around six and the average cost of an evening meal in a tourist restaurant costs around 30 euros per person, including a glass of wine or beer. So Lisbon is a great place for budget travellers. You can get great savings by visiting in the colder months. There are plenty of budget friendly hotels to choose from and there are many free things to see and do in Lisbon as well. You can visit the museums on the free or discounted admission days each month and get yourself a Lisbon card to save money on some of the best paid attractions. Eat authentic Portuguese food for cheap by visiting the local restaurants. We will leave some of our favourites in the description below. Also, stick to using the metro to get around. You can also check out last minute holiday packages to get cheap accommodation, flights and transfers in a packaged deal. Lisbon is often overlooked by travellers, so you can find some great deals on websites like lastminute.com and Holiday Pirates. So now let's look at the best things to do in Lisbon. Lisbon has plenty of incredible attractions to see. Head to Belém Tower, a fusion of architectural styles that make this a unique landmark. You can also ride Tram 28, a popular route that works its way up the steep cobbled roads of Lisbon. Visit the Alfama district, the oldest part of the city, but also make sure to check out the unique National Tile Museum. Head to the impressive St George's Castle, visit the many museums in the city and families can enjoy the huge Lisbon Oceanarium. Watch this video to find out the most beautiful cities in Europe. Then to learn about the cheapest places to visit in Europe, watch this video. We hope you have an incredible time in Portugal and stay creative.